Hello! In this video, I will show you how to record a track in Alpine Quest. Here we're at the main screen for Alpine Quest. First, you have to turn the GPS on, or make sure it's turned on. On the bottom left, there's a little crosshairs, and select that icon. We have the GPS position slider. We slide that on. Now it's turn green to indicate that it is um, getting a G or looking for a GPS signal. Now at this point it is not recording your track. It does show your location as a, a blue dot, but as soon as you lock the screen or switch to a different app, any sort of a, a track showing that you've moved will be cleared and it's, it's not being saved. To save your track, open up the, the crosshairs menu again. And right below GPS position, there is track recorder. And here you'll turn that on. And now it is recording and saving your track. Now we'll go back to the main screen and pan around the map. You'll notice there's a white dot in the center of the screen and there's a blue dot that shows your location on the map. There's an option, which I have turned on, to draw a blue line between those two dots. And then at the center of the map, it actually displays how long that line is. Here it shows it as 520 feet. Now open up the location menu again with the crosshairs. You notice when you first touch it, it centered the screen on your location and then I had to touch it again to actually open the menu. If you do a long press on GPS position it will show your GPS coordinates. Now we'll go back to that menu again and we'll do a long press on track recorder. Now this would show um, my track uh, recording, the, the length, the speed, the gain of loss in altitude, but since I'm not actually moving, there's nothing really to see here. Um, but we have the option of stopping and starting and saving the, the current record. We'll just stop it right now. Um, now we also have the option of looking at previously recorded tracks. So we're going to do that by touching on the recorded tracks uh, link. Now here are some of the previous tracks I have recorded. Um, we will select the Fish Canyon Narrows Area Familiarization Track. Here we have a, a small map view showing that the basic track, um, information about it, when it was recorded, the length of it, the time it took to, to do the track, the moving speed, and there's a graph at the bottom showing uh, altitude and speed, and you can display that as a full screen graph if you want more detail in it. Now at the top, there's an option of display. So by default, the, the track that, that you've recorded in the past are not displayed, but by clicking this box, like that, it will be displayed on your, your maps when you're looking at the maps. And I'll, you have the option to jump to the track. So we're going to select display and then we'll select jump to. And now the track is um, on the screen and we are being shown where, where it is, where the start of it is. I'm going to close the track recorder menu and I'll zoom in a little bit. You can see there, I'll pan down the track. The track is shown and there's little arrows on it to show the direction of travel. Zoom out. We can also touch the track to get information about it. So with a, a short touch, it brings up the name of it, Fish Canyon Narrows AFAM. We can touch uh, that name and bring up a, another option menu 
where we can share it or export it or see the details on this track. Um, this is the basics for recording and viewing tracks in Alpine Quest. If you have any questions about this, just post them in the comments. Thank you.